Hey there, it's Mindy, and today I'm finally sharing my full kitchen makeover. My plan for this budget makeover was to give the space a cafe feel by adding an island with seating and creating an overall cozy atmosphere by adding in some color and texture. Along with taking you through the process, I am breaking down the cost of everything I did to show you how this makeover was technically under $100. You'll find links to all the videos mentioned in the iCards on screen and in the description, as well as links to products used in this makeover. Let's get started. Hey, so I've already prepped the kitchen where all taped and everything. Um, I just wanted to show you the paint color before I start. I fell in love with this teal blue color by Claire, which is the same brand I use for my half bathroom makeover. And this color gives the kitchen so much warmth without making it too dark. I know some people hate painting, but I love it. So I got my kids involved in this process and we had a blast. As we go through the video, you'll see pop-ups with the cost for each DIY or update that I did. And at the end of the video, I'll give you the total cost of the entire makeover. So to add to the open feel, I decided to build these modern benches and that'll be linked. I made one for each side of the kitchen table, so it kind of feels like a booth. And this bench is a beginner friendly build, so check out that video tutorial if you're interested. And I'll also show you later how I upholstered them. I mentioned earlier that I added an island and to do this I made over this cube storage shelf and turned it into an island on wheels by adding a back to it and some caster wheels and making a countertop out of plywood. I thought this tip for taping off an area where you want to add furniture that I shared on Instagram was worth sharing again. So my island created space for these three additional seats, which I found for a steal on Facebook Marketplace. They were only $10 for all three, and I made them over with some new fabric and some spray paint. And it wouldn't be a Mindy makeover if I didn't add some DIY decor. I did run into one little snag with this makeover. My plan was to change the kitchen table by covering it with this vinyl fabric. But when I was ready to start on that project, I didn't feel like the color meshed well with the overall look. So I did what everyone else would do. I painted the table.
and this didn't cost me any extra because I had paint left over from the island project. If you're interested in my tips for painting furniture, I'll also link my coffee table makeover above. When it came to upholstering the benches I made, I found it cheaper to buy a full-size foam mattress topper instead of buying the standard upholstery foam, which can get expensive. So I cut it to size and doubled it to make the benches super comfy. And because I had also planned to use that vinyl fabric to cover these, I had to find an alternative as well. So instead of spending time searching for a new fabric, I opted to use some bench covers, which you'll see in a second, um, that I found on Amazon and they fit nice and snug and they are removable. So that means they'll be easy to take off and clean if necessary. And if you have kids, you know this is a win. So here is the final look of the kitchen. This is the before and the after. And you can see how just shifting the furniture around really opens up the space and makes it feel bigger even though I added more furniture. Here is the cost breakdown. All the projects and updates that I did came to a total of $348 but because I also sold the original kitchen chairs and two rugs that we were no longer using, I was able to use that $270 from those sales for this makeover, bringing the net cost to a whopping $78. If you are still watching, show me some love in the comments by leaving a paintbrush emoji. Don't forget to check out the description box for all the links mentioned and subscribe if you haven't already. For more budget room makeovers, click the playlist linked on the screen now. As always, thanks for watching!